Imagine studying in Europe with your tuition, travel, and living expenses fully covered. That's the Erasmus Mundus Scholarship for you. A golden ticket that opens the door to international education, this scholarship is a unique opportunity for students worldwide. It's not just about financial aid, it's about immersing yourself in a new culture, broadening your horizons, and participating in transnational study programs of high quality. But securing this scholarship isn't a walk in the park. It's a highly competitive process involving specific eligibility criteria, and yes, a motivation letter that sets you apart from the rest. This letter is your chance to shine, to showcase your passion, your goals, and why you deserve the scholarship. It's a critical component of your application, a chance to make a lasting impression. Now that you know what's at stake, you must be wondering how to pen down that award-winning motivation letter. Stay tuned as we delve into that next. If you're finding this video valuable, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more insightful content. We're here to help you navigate the complexities of the Erasmus Mundus Scholarship application and ensure your motivation letter stands out. Now, let's get back to our main topic. Tip number one, personalize your letter. Your motivation letter should reflect who you are. Yes, we're talking about that unique essence that makes you, well, you. When you write, infuse your personality into the words. Show the scholarship committee, the person behind the grades, the individual beyond the resume. This is not just about stating facts. It's about telling a story, your story. And remember, this is not a one-size-fits-all template. It's your motivation letter. So make it as unique as you are. Differentiate yourself from the pool of applicants by highlighting what makes you special your experiences, your aspirations, your perspective. These are the things that set you apart. So don't shy away from letting your personality shine. Now, moving on to tip number two, focus on your academic and professional achievements. Yes, your grades are important, but they're just a part of the story. Your achievements, both in the academic and professional realm, are a testament to your dedication, your hard work and your passion. They are the evidence that you can excel in the Erasmus Mundus Masters program. So when writing your motivation letter, don't just mention your achievements, explain them. Discuss the challenges you overcame, the skills you gained, the impact you made. Show them how these accomplishments have shaped you and how they've prepared you for the journey ahead. Remember, your achievements are your unique selling points. They showcase your potential, and that's exactly what the scholarship committee is looking for. So don't be modest. This is your time to shine. Put your best foot forward and let your achievements speak for themselves. Moving on to tip number three, be specific and concise. You might have a lot to say, but remember, the people reading your letter are busy. They'll appreciate it if you get straight to the point. Concrete examples of your achievements and experiences will have a much stronger impact than vague statements. Make each word count and avoid repeating the same information. This will demonstrate your ability to communicate effectively and respect the reader's time, which are valuable skills in any academic or professional setting. Now, let's dive into the fourth tip, explaining your future goals and how the scholarship will help in achieving them. This is your chance to show the committee that you have a clear vision for your future and you've thought about how the Erasmus Mundus Scholarship fits into that plan. Don't be afraid to dream big, but also make sure your goals are feasible and relevant to the scholarship you're applying for. Remember, the committee wants to invest in someone who will make the most out of this opportunity. So talk about the skills you hope to gain, the experiences you're looking forward to, and how these will contribute to your long-term career plans. And don't forget to tie it back to the Erasmus Mundus program. 
show them that you understand the value of this unique opportunity and how it can enhance your learning experience. Your future goals show your ambition and the scholarship committee loves that. Tip number five, show your knowledge about the Erasmus Mundus Scholarship. You see, it's not just about convincing the selection committee that you deserve the scholarship. It's also about demonstrating that you understand what the scholarship is all about. This means doing your homework about what the Erasmus Mundus Scholarship entails, its values, its goals, how it works, and what it offers. It's about showing that you know what you're getting into and that you're excited about it. Remember, the selection committee is looking for candidates who are not just bright and deserving, but also genuinely interested and committed to the cause of the scholarship. Now let's move on to tip number six, honesty. And it's as simple as it sounds. Be honest in your letter. Don't embellish your achievements or make up stories the selection committee can tell. Instead, focus on your real experiences, your real struggles and your real achievements. Talk about how these experiences have shaped you and motivated you to apply for the scholarship. Authenticity resonates with people. Your truth is your strength and it's what will set you apart from the rest. So whether you're talking about your understanding of the Erasmus Mundus scholarship or your personal experiences, remember, honesty is always the best policy. Now to our final two tips. Tip seven, proofread your letter. No matter how confident you are about your writing skills, proofreading is a must. It's not just about checking for typos or grammatical errors. It's about making sure your letter is clear, concise, and coherent. Every sentence should add value and eliminate any fluff or redundancy. Remember, a well-polished letter shows your diligence and attention to detail. Moving on to tip eight, get feedback on your letter. It's crucial to have a fresh set of eyes look over your letter. They might pick up on things you've missed, provide a new perspective, or suggest improvements that you hadn't considered. This could be a mentor, a teacher, or even a fellow applicant. Don't shy away from criticism. Use it to refine and improve your letter. Remember, feedback is the breakfast of champions. To sum it up, we've walked through eight crucial tips for crafting an outstanding Erasmus Mundus motivation letter. We've talked about personalizing your letter, showcasing your academic achievements, demonstrating your international outlook and expressing your career aspirations. We've also emphasized the importance of aligning your goals with the Erasmus Mundus objectives, displaying your adaptability, and lastly, proofreading your letter meticulously. Remember, your letter of motivation could be the key to unlock your dream of studying in Europe with the Erasmus Mundus Scholarship. So make it count.